Hey, are you ready for some hunting on the Tommy Wilcox Show? Tommy Wilcox Outdoors is brought to you by Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. Mahindra Tractors, built for the long haul. Peach Outdoors, get the motor running on your next project with our Mahindra Tractors, ATVs, or lawn equipment. Tuscaloosa Toyota, one price, one place. Real tree camouflage, family, friends, and the outdoors. Game face turkey calls. When you head to the woods, bring your game face. Talladega County Exchanges for all your feed and agricultural needs. All music courtesy of country music legend Hank Williams Jr. Hey folks, welcome to today's show. You know, for a long time, one of the things I had on my bucket list was uh, the opportunity to take the Grand Slam. And what that is, is all four species of turkeys in the United States. The Eastern, the Osceola, the Rio, and the Merriam. And I wanted the opportunity to be able to call them all up by myself with my own calls and to videotape every one of them. And I was fortunate in it this year to be able to do that and I want to show that to you. Uh, first of all, Eastern is by far the hardest turkey out of all of them to take. So if, uh, if you can take an Eastern, you can take all the rest of them. So first up is going to be the Eastern since it was the hardest. I'm at Uncle Doyle's and I had two come in on me pretty quick with a lot of action. Take a look at the first turkey uh, that I was able to take in my Grand Slam attempt this year. Trill Pin Fayette got an afternoon hunt at Uncle Doyle's. I'm actually going to sit on the field. Hopefully, it's been raining a lot. They'll come in here and try to dust or scratch a little bit before they go to the roost. I'm going to try to call them up here. Got big hollows all the way around us. It's been cloudy all day, but the sun's fixing to come out. So hopefully, we'll get a few gobblers out in the field for you this afternoon. I'm gonna be hunting with the uh, Bama Hammer Mesquite, covered in bronze glass, and this is a heck of a call. It's a lot different sound, so I'm gonna use that today. See if we can't hammer us in Alabama. Turkey with the Bama Hammer, y'all stay with us. come right on into the decoys fluffed up was beating my little Jake up uh, I shot uh, I dropped one I think I hit the other one I hope I didn't wound it too bad but uh it ran off in the woods over there but anyway gosh that was a exciting I just look up and two come flying in here running in here went right into Jake Wow Let's go take a look at him. Here we go, folks. 
Got a real nice gobbler. Look at that beard. Wow. Ooh, big old heavy, thick beard. Big old head. Big, beautiful. Beautiful fan. As you've seen, he came flying in here after this Jake. I got these Avion Jakes and uh, got a hen up here. Two of them came in here to beat him up. Uh, I had called and uh, had the Bama hammer and I was just clucking on it, purring on it and uh, doing a little yelping. And uh, these birds probably came from a pretty good distance when they got here. They seen uh, Mr. Decoy and the Bama Hammer, and we shut him up. What a turkey! That's a heavy sucker. That turkey is going to go 22 pounds easy. He's got. Pretty good spurs, little over an inch spurs. So uh, it's a good turkey, man. All right, let's get him loaded up, get him out of here, and uh, chalk up another one to our game face call. All right, folks, that'll do it for the Eastern. We're gonna take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back with the Osceola. Y'all stay with us. All right, folks, welcome back to the show. I'm Tommy Wilcox. This is Tommy Wilcox Outdoors. And this particular show is dealing with the Grand Slam, which is the uh, Eastern, Osceola, Rio, and the Merriam. Next up on the list this year, I was fortunate to get the opportunity to go to Florida and hunt with John Stone. And uh, he hooked us up with some great guys down there, and I was able to take Osceola. And this thing came in hot and heavy. Y'all take a look. We're down around Polk County, which is uh, just about 45 minutes outside of Tampa. We're on some beautiful ground here. There's supposed to be a bunch of Osceolas, a lot of live oaks, a lot of water, a lot of swamp, a lot of cows, a little bit of everything. But. Uh, we set up in the shade pretty good where the sun can't uh, make us stand out. And uh, I got my decoys out there about 30 yards. And I'm going to sit down and see if I can't call them up with the Bama Hammer. We're going to see if we can't make some racket here in the state of Florida with our Bama Hammer. Uh, so sit tight. Let's see if we can't call you in in Osceola.
Alright folks, here we are in Florida, Osceola. That's what we wanted right there. Wanted to come to Florida and get one with the Bama Hammer. And it's, it's crazy, it's getting a little late. And uh, I had two decoys set out there and I've seen him, I yelped and cut, yelped and cut. And I've seen him come running from 200 yards away, got in, he'd stop, blow up, go forward, stop, blow up. Then he finally made it to my decoys, maybe on decoys. I was able to take him real nice. Osceola, Turkey, what it's all about right there, my boy. All right, folks, that'll do it for the Osceola. Now that that's out the way, we're going to go on to Texas and take the Rio Grande. We're going to take a quick commercial break first. Y'all stay with us. My friends all call me Superman. I never let nobody get an upper hand. Hey folks, welcome back to the show, where uh, the whole show today is about the 2015 Grand Slam that I was fortunate to take. Uh, I've already taken the Eastern, the Osceola, and uh, we headed out to Texas to hunt with a good friend of mine, J.B. Hoffman, who has a wonderful place down there, and the Rios were very vocal, so uh, y'all take a look at my Rio hunt out in Texas.
Rio down in Texas. Man, what an exciting hunt, man. That's a big old Rio right there, folks. Big, big old thick, big old heavy beard. It's got, got three beards. Got one, two, got three beards. Three beards on this turkey. Wow. Look at the spurs. Look at the spurs on that baby. Look at the tail. What a beautiful bird. JB Hoffman, thank you so much, man, for letting us come down. It's been a ball, man. It's been a ball. Time you can come to Texas and get you a three bearded gobbler. You can't beat that, man. Wow. Hey folks, welcome back to the show. There's one turkey left, and that's the Merriam. And uh, we went up to North Nebraska. We hunted with Goblin Grunts, and uh, they got a wonderful place up there. Uh, nice lodge, and a lot, a lot of turkeys. And uh, Donnie McCall was with me, and I tell you, we kind of split up on this particular hunt. He went on one side of the river, and I went on the other side of the river. But, uh, the first time I hit my call, those turkeys gobbled, and I knew it was on. Here's the Merriam from North Nebraska. Alright folks, that'll do it for this week's show. Thanks so much for tuning in. I especially want to thank Donnie McCall and Lance Shores, my camera guys, for helping out uh, on this long journey uh, for the Grand Slam and a lot of hours on the road. And I want to thank you all for tuning in and watching. It's a, uh, it's, it's a fun thing to be able to have something that's a goal of yours and to go out there and achieve it. And... Uh, the Grand Slam was just that, and with a little luck, I was fortunate to be able to take them. And I took every one of those turkeys with the Bama Hammer, made by Game Face Calls. So if you get a chance, go to TommyWilcox.com or GameFaceCalls.com. Check out the Bama Hammer. It put the hammer on turkeys all over the country. See you next week.
gassed up, loaded down, trucking on from town to town. Guns, bows, and a tackle box. Here come Tommy Wilcox. Hitting the water, hitting the woods. That Bama boy sure got it good. Always having too much fun. 